The internet is the technology of the 21st century. It's going to affect our lives in ways that we can't yet even imagine. We have more and more smartphones, we have laptops, we have tablets. The amount of electricity that we need for that is just becoming outrageous. Green Touch was launched in 2010 with an ambitious goal of improving energy efficiency in communication networks by a factor of a thousand. Not 10%, not 100, but a thousand. When you give people a mission to improve something by 50%, they tend to stay within the same mindset. But when you really go after a big goal, it frees their mind to think differently, think more disruptively. I remember that when we launched, there was a lot of skepticism. We were talking about uh, working together with a lot of these industry stakeholders, competitors even within the vendor communities, with service operators. We also think about research institutes and universities. So a lot of skepticism. But now, five years later, we can prove that we were right. On June 18th, we're really celebrating the end of that five-year journey the great work that a lot of people have put in, the research, the ideas, the creativity of a lot of researchers from 48 members throughout the world. I'm Rod Tucker from the University of Melbourne. I'm Jafran Murkani. This is Chilling Yi from China Mobile. We organized Green Touch along three different working groups. The first one is the wireless network. That's really how you connect with your mobile device to the network. The second is uh, the fixed access working group, which is all about how you connect in your residential or your enterprise networks with wires. And then the third working group is really the core network, which is the optical backbone, the nationwide backbone network. And so we organized in these three working groups, and each working group had then their mission to define specific technologies, architecture, solutions. In 2013, we basically said for the first time, let's look at the consolidation of what we have and we called it the green meter. Uh, the green meter shows you how energy efficient you are within a communications network infrastructure. So we were shooting for 1,000 and with wireless we can actually improve the energy efficiency by a factor of 10,000. For mobile networks, it really translates into a energy savings of 99%. This would mean taking 3.6 million cars off the road. That's fabulous. I want Green Touch to be remembered for a couple of things. The Open Innovation Initiative has been identified as a green light by the World Economic Forum. Green Touch is a very unique consortium. From the end users, through the network, into cloud and data centers, all of it has been tackled. The telecommunications industry will look back at Green Touch as being the organization that started the change. Green Touch is really at the forefront and the trailblazers for the energy efficient network of the future. Une coopération entre partenaires pour partager notre connaissance est une recette idéale pour sauvegarder notre planète. So blij dat wij als IMEC deelgenomen hebben aan Green Touch. Lüüse Weilai. Man wird immer wieder stärker gesehen. Recherche über Energie und Kommunikationstechnologien aus dem nächsten Horizont, den wir müssen erreichen. Don't we all want to leave behind a greener planet?